yeah, this is you. I mean, probably everyone else out there. Constantly scrolling through social media and comparing ourselves to celebrities and their high unrealistic beauty standards. Adding things on your wish list and not buying them. Money is the primary thing and secondary thinking that it won't look good on you. Or you're not, or you won't look good in that. Guys, you think you're a potato. Girl, stop. Let me tell you one thing. That there's nothing wrong with you. You just need a, need a bit of confidence. And of course, how to dress. And just let your fits also hit hard. So dude, let's just get into it. So, your celebrities are not jadugas. That they look literally gorgeous every single piece of clothing that they wear. Actually, they have invested time, efforts and money in stylists. But yeah, all of us can't do it. So yeah, here's a few tips which, which will actually make you look really amazing. So yeah, let's just dive right into it. So basically, I'm gonna start with the body types and like I'll just show you three, four different kind of clothing. And without a Photoshop, you can like literally alter a bit, bit of your reality and the body shape, like your body type a bit. So yeah, without any ado, let's now just get started. So we're gonna start off with, uh, so I'm gonna tell about dresses, tops and pants. And we're gonna start with, I'm looking like uh, Salman Khan from Tere Na. Just tell me in the comment section. <laughs> Actually, it felt good when I did it, but now it's too much. And I just washed my hair, so it's a little messy. Bhi hai. But anyways, let's just so yeah, let's just start with the bottom. So I'm gonna show you side by side the view of both the clothing items and how they differ from each other. So uh, I wore mom jeans and the wide leg jeans wide leg pants so talking about the wide leg pants it doesn't even leave a, it covers you from top to bottom like it doesn't leave space for people to think the people to imagine anything so if you're a pear shaped body and, and you want your legs to look thinner thinner slimmer and longer then then I feel wide leg jeans or wide leg pants are your go to like it creates an illusion of you looking taller and the best part how does it idea is it? On the other hand, skinny jeans just fits your body really well, gives a cinch look. So the skinny fit jeans or the mom jeans which I'm wearing, it just enhances your features. So if you want to draw people's attention towards your curves and your legs, like enhance it, the skinny fit is the best option for you. So let me just tell you once again, for looking taller and engulfing the body area and slimmer, for mostly for most mostly for pear shaped body, you can go for uh, you can definitely go for wide leg pants. And if you want to enhance your body features and attract attention towards your body features and your curves, so then skinny fit. I mostly opt for wide legs because I feel mostly hawa ani chahiye. Second, I just want like not that short five five, but still I want an illusion to make me look a little bit more taller. So yeah. Moving on to our favorite dresses. Dresses in dresses, I'm gonna be talking about body cons and uh, skater dress. So uh, first, talking about the body cons, it fits and enhances your body again, like the skinny fit jeans. Both the body con dress definitely will attract attention towards your curve, uh, curves. So if you wanna look glamorous and enhance your body features more, you can obviously go for body con dress any day. But if you want to draw away attention from your thighs or from your curves, then you can obviously opt for A-line dresses as, as it creates an illusion, a room between your the, where the fabric ends and where your legs start. So you can move again in that comfortably and that will look very cute. I basically wear both uh, body cons and skater dresses. Um, I like to wear body cons when I want to look kind of like hourglass and when I want to be comfy in my own zone with sneakers, I'll wear A-line skater so, yeah. Let's now move on to the top. So we're going to talk about the V hem and the straight cut of the jeans. Um, sorry, of the top. So basically, V hem is like the end of the top being in V shape, the hem. And um, the straight ones as traditional being the straight. So basically, I also have two, three V hems, and they are absolutely stunning. But you can convert your straights into V hem by doing this. And V hem, 
like literally cinches towards your waist and it like cl- creates a layer from your waist till your leg which in turn makes you look really taller like as compared to a straight fit and like it's a boot you should try if you don't have a v hem you can definitely try putting like tucking in your tops as v hem shape leaving your t-shirt outside is always on lower hand as compared to tucking your t-shirt inside it will look much sleek and put together so yeah this was all for this time i hope this thing helps you all i would definitely put some more videos on these topics if you want me to put definitely up for it and yeah please 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 don't come up on me on the comment section ki how consistent and all those things also after like losing many of my subscribers and like two three of my videos i obviously had a little demotivation but now i'm but now i'm back again and i i do need you guys support so yeah do subscribe like and do comment down below whatever video you want next and yeah college vlogs will also be up and i'll be i'll try to be as consistent as possible stay with me guys we got this and yeah ye pen maine aise aaj hue hath mein hai so i am using it so yeah don't forget to subscribe and love you all bye